Hi, I'm Shelly Levette with Child Care Land Com. Today I want to share with you a project that's great for fine motor skills development as well as scissor skills development. It's very inexpensive and easy to set up. All you need to have is cardstock paper. You can even use colored cardstock paper. Black looks really um, nice with this as well. And you need to have um, these foam pieces of foam. And these are sold at um, most of the craft stores, Walmart, you can get them at Oriental dot com online and they're just colored pieces of foam and this is usually the size that I start with they come in uh, sizes are about double this length this is the size that I purchased so it's a longer piece and then I cut those in half and um, put out a variety of colors for children to self select from and what they would do is they would just choose whatever colors they want and they would cut, cut out whatever shapes that they want and then once they've cut those shapes out they would then glue them on to their paper. And what I like about foam is it's a little bit thicker than paper, but it's not so thick that it's really hard for children to cut through. So it adds a little resistance, which helps, helps to develop um, the scissor skills, but it's still easy enough for them to cut through. And you can make all kinds of different shapes. They can be as creative as they want make as large as they want, as small as they want, as different colored many different colors as they want to use and then once they've done with that then they just glue it in wherever they want which then adds itself to the fine lower skills because they have to pick up the pieces of foam and glue them on but this is really a great project for um, when you need a quieter activity or just to put out stuff in the art center in when children first arrive or they're waiting for a pickup time or waiting to go home it's just something fun for them to do. They all love foam, they all love glue, and this gives them a great opportunity uh, to cut as well. So I'm not sure how many pieces I've cut out, but they would put some glue on their paper and then they would just press the foam pieces on that and make some kind of a design, any kind that they wish. But again, it's a lot of fun. There's a variety of colors to choose from when picking out foam. You don't have to use these pastel colors. There's all different kinds of colors. But we're getting closer to spring, so I thought a little more pastel was nice on there. But it gives them a great chance to work on those fine motor skills development as well as cutting skills, which is so important for them. For a foam collage, I'm Shelly Levette with ChildCareLand.com, and thanks for watching.